getting down, 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 down If everything you've said is false, but you from the dance floor And you want it now, 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 now Don't know what you're there for, bring it over here In the middle of the crowd, inside my sound Seeing through your eyelids, and I know you like it When the music gets loud So this is the first episode of past trading and as you guys saw I was weighing in at 74.5 kgs so this is my starting weight and towards the end of this series I want to finish off at somewhere around 65 65ish kgs because last time when I stepped on stage I was around 62 kgs and I feel that I would have put in at least uh, 2 to 3 kgs of muscle mass that's what I believe and I've been bulking for almost one and a half to two years now I think it's almost one and a half years that I've been bulking one year and eight months and even if you bulk for one year and eight months the ma I think two to three kgs of muscle mass is what you can do if you're natural the rate at which you put muscle is going to be very very slow and so so just because you gain a lot of weight doesn't mean you've gained a lot of muscle that's what people think so just because they gain 10 kgs they think that you know they've gained at least five five kgs of more of muscle but that's not how it works even if you gain 2 to 3 kgs of muscle, that's like a huge thing. So I believe that I've gained 2 to 3 kgs in the past 2 years. And that is why this time I want to be at around 65 kgs on a step on stage. And that's what I think will be suitable for me. And I want to go, I want to push myself even harder this time and go to a lower body fat. Last time I was at a pretty low body fat, I know that. And I was pretty comfortable at that body fat. Frankly speaking, I didn't have any problems. So. I personally think that I can push myself to a lower body fat and still not have any problems so this time that's what I'm going to do I'm going to do my best and push as much as I can and reach that 65 kgs so we have around 3 months to drop around 9 kgs of weight and the second thing that I noticed is last time when I started I was at around 70, uh, 75 to 76 kgs around the same weight but I was not as lean as this. Right now I'm 75 kgs but, I, but I'm relatively leaner to where I started last time. So this is how the prep is going to go and also we are pretty close to the launch. So uh, you know about the brand and things like that. So, I, so I, I actually have a lot of things to do. So it's not just it's, it's not about me prepping and staying at home. I still have to travel a lot. I still have to go back and forth to the office and stuff. So this is going to be a challenge for me because I have to pack my meals, I have to take my meals along with me wherever I go and so you guys can, so people who are working, you guys can relate to me so it's not just that, you know, this, this, this is all I'm doing, I'm, I'm just sitting at home and prepping this is not how it works so I still have a busy, you know, uh, schedule, I still have to, you know, take care of this, take care of that so I'll be traveling a lot and fitting my meals when I'm doing that is going to be a challenge and that is something that you guys can relate to because you know, I'm sure all of like most of you all will be working somewhere, and it it gets hard for you to fit your meals when you work at an office and things like that. So you guys can learn that from this series too. So yeah, I'll give you guys more updates on this series as we go further. 
So let's try for my first meal right now. I'm gonna have some cereals. So I'm gonna have this. This is my favorite, favorite, favorite cereal. And the macros are really good on this, okay? So this is actually uh, made out of ragi. It's called Soulful uh, Chocophils. And the macros, like for one serving 30 grams, has around uh, 165 calories. It has around five grams of protein for one serve. So I'll, I'll be doing two serves of this. So basically I'll be doing like 60 servings of the, um, 60 grams of this. So it will give me 10 grams of protein. And also, I want you guys to see this. So this is like the new cereal from uh, Muzzle Blaze, you know, it's a high protein cereal and I'm like, I was very skeptical before trying this because I've never had high protein cereals and I've had protein bars, but I, I never liked protein bars because you know, they never had a good taste. So I was very skeptical before trying this, but once I tried it out, it tastes like a normal cereal. It has like all these dry fruits and all inside. So it's pretty tasty. I highly recommend you guys to try this out because this is not very costly. This, this is almost the same as a normal cereal. And uh, I'll, I'll, I'll show you guys the macros of this. I'm not sure you guys can see it. It's not focused. So for one serving of this, you get 10 grams of protein, which is pretty good, right? You get 10 grams of proteins and then uh, you get like 35 grams of carbs. You get uh, 0.25 grams of fat. So it's very low in fat. It's good in carbs and it's high in proteins. So I think once I get deeper into the cut, I'll start using this cereal because this has like three to four grams of fat and I don't want to waste my you know fats on this. So once I get deeper into the cut, I'll I'll start using something like this. So that's it. So let's let's begin. So hectic. Trust me, a lot of them do I gotta say that I'm proud of them too Most of these people spend hours in school End up with nothing but a sour view Couple of papers that they power through Ooh. Yeah, yeah, please do not step in my way This is my time, my voice is power, yes I put my weapon to play I just need to get my footing correct I just need to get my head in the game I just need to let them know if they fuck with the kid I'll probably paint them red in the aim I'm not mad, it's all cool I know you don't fuck with the shit I do But I still love you But I still love you Rolling, 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 rolling with it I'm not mad, rolling with it It's all cool, rolling with it I know you don't fuck with the shit I do But I still love you Rolling with it With it, rolling, 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 rolling. They think they know what I'm worth. It's such a shame. They think they could put a price on my name. I guess I'll tell them, tell them again. I am the chosen one. All I got in this life, I live is one shot like the golden gun. Won't stop till I'm holding one. Yeah, I put the blood in the sweat. 
I put the cut in the check Don't come and tell me I owe you a dollar When I'm the only one that's coming correct Fuck being friends with the cousin of death I'm the executive running the set I'll take you out on the strip with my 007 whip Then hit the button eject Tell them all this is me doing my thing I'll never let anyone ruin my thing I'm struggling with people coming inside of my studio Who knows who they might bring Too many snakes in the grass Too many phonies and fakes in the past I did the favor of cutting them out of the picture And I can only pray it lasts last, last. I decided that I won't care from one about vlogging on the road. That's like my new year resolution. Yes, you shouldn't. I don't. You, you don't shouldn't. do what? I don't care if I vlog on the road. Like I can just go to the camera, walk around. I don't care. Be careful so you don't die. Whatever I have in a place will be like uh stress and wear at home in my house. Is it on? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hi, what's up guys? So we just finished like the first official workout of past day and it was pretty epic you know it was a really good workout and you know what like this time I'm actually planning to make sure that there are a lot of uh, commentaries on the workout rather than edits there are going to be edits but there are going to be commentary also because I want you guys to know what's happening and uh, because this this series should be informative and you should be able to take something out of it rather than just watching edits uh, also, the people doing the transformation challenge can learn from Yeah, it. exactly. So, the transformation challenge is functional. A lot of people are registered. I'm super happy about that. I think by the time this goes live, there's like another day or two to register. So, make sure you register fast. So, right now, we are going to go put some petrol because uh, I'm on empty. That's my like cars, no my car always runs on empty. Like, I don't know why. Cause I, like, yesterday, me and Kriti were going on a long drive. And I forgot that I didn't have petrol. And like halfway through, we remember that I didn't have petrol, and it was already on empty. And we are like searching for bunks. It would have been pretty bad if we couldn't find one. Yeah, but you know? we did. Yeah, we'd be like stuck in the middle of a highway. We're badass. With no petrol. Yeah, we're badass. <laughs> we're, we're savage. We're savage. We're savage. We're savage. So we're going to make some pasta and fish for lunch Okay, so uh, We bought this yesterday This is a chili basil pasta uh, fish Or pasta is basically a na the name of the fish So this is pre-seasoned and it is ready to cook So just have to put it like one minute on each side And then it's cooked So pretty easy So we're going to have like 100 grams of fish each I know it's not a lot but you know We'll probably have eggs, egg or something after that So 100 grams of fish each And then we're doing some pasta and we bought this sauce yesterday. Where's the sauce? It's inside. No, the sauce is here. Okay. So we bought some sauce. Uh, yes, it's here. So this is the sauce that we bought for pasta. So basically, it's always better to make uh, pasta with some sauce which is ready-made. This is the, the uh, red sauce pasta, and I think. It's for two of us, so we'll like use half of the jar, which is like 200 grams, 
and the macros are not bad guys this macro is actually really good for each of 100 grams it has like some uh, 13 carbs 2 grams of fat and then like uh, 4 grams of protein so we're doing like that's the macros that each of us are getting from the sauce it's pretty good and where's the pasta? the pasta is So this is the pasta we are using, it's like uh, penne pasta I think, it, it's fusilli pasta. So we are going to first cook the pasta and then I will show you guys what happens after. That's like half packet gone. So basically I am doing like uh, 150 grams of pasta and then Kriti is doing like 100 grams of pasta. So that's a lot of macros in the, in the meal but we are like hungry, we just like finished the workout. Uh, tip when you make pasta is always put salt that uh, like it will flavor your pasta and the second thing is when you add salt to water it increases its boiling point so you know the pasta looks faster Genius. there's so much of pressure on me what yeah like how is how is that pressure i don't know first episode of fast trading that's a lot of pressure Who did that? Who did that? I did that. What? <laughs> I just chopped it. What? I chopped no, you did not. That was me. Oh, please don't take the credit for that. <laughs> I did that. So yeah, I can chop onions like this. I'll take a pan and I'll fry. I'll like you know saute these onions. Like put some spices and stuff, and then I'll be adding this uh, you know. Uh, paste or this pasta sauce and I'll let it boil for a while and then I'll add the you know cooked pasta on this mixture we mix it up and that's pasta so after that we have to like uh, the pasta is, once the pasta is ready since we have only like one induction pan mm -hmm. then we take another pan and then we cook the fish so that is the sauces sauces like what is it Pasta sauce. Pasta sauce that's all ready to go and the pasta and the meal is getting done by the one and chef. What are you doing now? I'm making the fish for some proteins. So yeah, this is the butter fish. Gosh. Watch it. So this is like the final product. So this is mine and this is Kriti's bowl. Yes. So we have some fish, we have some pasta. I'm gonna put the macros on the screen right now. Take a look at it and we'll get back to you after we eat.